welcome back to our weekly roundup of the Premier League action. I am thrilled to dive into the 10 biggest talking points from the past weekend's football matches. Let's get started. Talking point number one, familiar lessons beckon for Levy. First up, let's talk about Tottenham Hotspurs. Ange Postacoglu's tenure started with a bang, but lately it seems like they're returning to the mean. However, it's still hope for Spurs if Levy backs his man in the summer transfer window. Looking point number two, Haaland makes Forest pay. Moving on to Manchester City's win against Nottingham Forest, where Erling Haaland proved divisive once again. His introduction turned the tide for City, highlighting Forest's defensive vulnerabilities and Seth Peace struggles. Talking point number three, injuries catch up with Liverpool. Liverpool's title charge took a hit, with injuries playing a significant role in their recent struggles. As they lick their wounds, attention turns to addressing those issues for next season under Arnie Slot. Talking point number four, United mess, not all Ten Hag's fault. Man United's stagnation under Eric Ten Hag raised questions about the club's management and ownership. The comparisons with David Moyes' tenure emphasised the need for stability and to support any manager to succeed. Talking point number five, Dice pulls off a major achievement. Sean Dice's remarkable feat of guiding Everton to safety, despite numerous challenges, deserves recognition. His ability to navigate through adversity showcases his managerial prowess. Talking point number six, De Zerbe's sorry season fizzles out. Brighton's disappointing season prompt introspection from the manager Roberto De Zerbe. His acknowledgement of the team's shortcomings reflects his commitment to improve for the future. Talking point number seven, Wolves raging against the machine. Wolves fans expressed their frustrations with VAR during their match against West Ham, highlighting the ongoing concern with technology implementing correctly in football. Talking point number eight, Villa's close in on their targets. Aston Villa continue to progress their season. They secure Europa League qualification and now set sights on their Champions League qualification as they have now got clear space above Tottenham. Unai Emery's leadership is pivotal in them achieving these goals. Talking point number nine, Glasner's aim to fly high with the Eagles. Crystal Palace's draw against Fulham hints at higher aspirations under Oliver Glasner's management. With potential departures looming, reinforcements and strategic planning are crucial for the future success. Talking point number 10, the free Salma protest at Newcastle. Newcastle fans make a poignant statement in support of Salma al Shiba in light on the important social issues amidst the football spectacle. That wraps up our weekend Premier League action. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more football content. Until next time, stay tuned and enjoy the beautiful game. Goodbye.